Hello, dinky do. It's just me, Scotty McClure. And of course, we're live on Facebook just for you, saying welcome, welcome, welcome to one of the world's top broadcast platforms. And um, I thought we'd just pop up, have a bit of a catch up with me hearties and see what's happening here. So do come and join me because I've got so much to tell you and I've got so little time to tell you in. So there you are. So spread the word. Tell 10, tell 10, tell 10, tell 10 about Scotty McClue live just for you. There's the wonderful Fred Walton watching. Dinky do, Fred. Lovely to have you with us. Gordon Roddick, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us, of course. And uh, just a quick pop-up to appraise you all of the situation. Alexander Hunter, Rab's watching us. Excellent. Bachetti Giuseppe, I saw you today. Fantastic. On the uh, on the old Facebook Live. And of course, we've had quite a lot of argy bargy with you lot, which is amazing. There's the fabulous Alistair King. Oh, my goodness me. I wish you stayed next door, Alistair King, because... Um, I could certainly find lots for you to do with this motor car. <laughs> Dinky do, Scotty. Dinky do, Alistair. How fantastic. Just a quick pop up to catch. Marvellous. Quick Skype call there. How fantastic is that? My Wi Fi is having some issues. I thought you said my wife is having some issues, but my Wi Fi. Life has frozen. We should be back now. Um, fantastic. And everybody's on there watching. Share and share and share, guys, as quickly as you can. I've got so much to tell you and so little time to do it in. How amazing is that? So, what we had there was a Skype call. And uh, it's just to let you know now, could you hear every bit of that? Were you able to hear the Skype call? Very, very important. I'm just going to do a bit of sharing. Here we go there. And uh, get this shared. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Very exciting times. I've been doing live pop-ups on YouTube. So if you can get on to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel, you'll see these. We're trying to work out an optimum time. And we're building up the show and we're taking Skype calls. So there you are. So obviously, best behavior if anybody's Skyping in. You know, we don't want to, uh, we don't want to have to give anybody a lifetime ban. So there we are. I did have to give one woman a lifetime ban who'd caused a lot of trouble. So there we are. So she got a lifetime ban. I can tell you that. For nothing. How fantastic is that? So there you go. And uh, the live froze, Scotty. I missed it. Oh, you missed the Skype call. Yes, it shouldn't have done, I don't know that it was anything at this end. But you never know because obviously we're adding new facilities to the, uh, the stream all the time. Scotty, how do I watch you on YouTube? You just put in, you go and put into your Google Scotty McClure YouTube channel and up it will come and you subscribe and um, then you'll see the pop-ups. Fantastic. And we've got quite a little squad watching at the moment, but we need to obviously build up the subscribers. There's just under a couple of thousand subscribers. So if everybody can subscribe to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel, www.youtube.com forward slash user forward slash Scotty McClue one. Excellent. Henry Anderson's watching. Dinky do. So there we are. Ian, you will enjoy the YouTube as well. They are fantastic broadcasts and there's a terrific crowd watching at the moment. So we like that. We only started the other day, but it's building and building at a tremendous rate. Very, very exciting. So there's massive opportunity for the future. And those of you that have stuck with me through thick and thin, um, you know, I'm not talking about myself at the moment. Obviously, you know, I'm not thin. And hopefully, I'm not, well, we'll not go there. Um, but uh, what I was going to say to you is that um, we will be doing our pop-ups, but I wanted to add new facilities because I don't want you thinking, oh, yes, I, I did watch Scotty, but a lot of it's a wee bit samey. We don't want that, so uh, I've introduced the Skype so that we can actually have a chit-chat. The weather's blowing a hoolie out there, Scotty. I reckon that's the cause of the freeze on life. 
It could well be Alistair, absolutely. Or the word goes out that McClure's live and everything just freezes up, just jams up. So there we are. I wonder about the days when we, we blocked off the network for Central Scotland with 460,000 calls in a week. <laughs> if we got back to that, tremendous stuff. This was, I can remember looking into all this in 1998. Here we are, somebody is Skyping. We love that. Hello, you're live on Scotty. Who's that? Uh, Aaron again. Oh, when the Skype came in there, as soon as you answered Skype, the live froze. Ah, right. So what I'll have to do is take Skype off one of the devices then so you couldn't hear a thing, Alistair. Ah, that's a bit of a shame. Right. So I've got Skype on another device here. It must have got itself on there as well. So what I'll have to do is take Skype off there, and um, then you can Skype me live. You see, on the YouTube shows, it's not a problem. So there we are. But I'll need to take it off here, and, and then uh, we can get you on the other device. So I do apologize for that, folks. But there we are. These are the things, and uh, set to try us. So as soon as I answered the Skype on here, then it froze the broadcast. Uh, that's why I'm not on Messenger. I think it has a similar effect. Hello, pal. Hope you're having a good weekend. The wonderful Thomas Hamilton. I am Tom. Fantastic stuff. Uh, very excited about the YouTube broadcasts because we've added another string to the bow. You see, if I'm honest about it, I know you all uh, have a giggle here. Uh, what are we getting here from somebody? Stuart says, Scotty, I've lost all faith in politicians especially uh, with the expose about Scotland's finance. Uh, it's time to elect ordinary people to run our country. Um, so there you are. And do it on an expenses-only post. No expenses. Um, not, not on their expenses. Your thoughts. Very, very interesting. Um, but obviously I'm not going to make a comment on uh, any specific individuals or anything like that, because politics, like any other field, um, you know, some people make mistakes, and uh, and and there that goes. Uh, but obviously, I'm not going to discuss any individuals on here. But uh, it's interesting. I get approached all the time asking me if I'm interested in being a politician. But the only thing is, I would imagine the first thing they would say to me when I arrived at the House of Commons, one of the whips would get a hold of me and say, now then, bit of advice, you shut up. You see, that sort of idea. I may be wrong, but it's just a thought I've got. Uh, you know, and as you know, Scotty McClure does not appreciate being told to shut up. So that would be that. So I need to stand as an independent. Yes, it was frozen. Can I have a shout out, says Derek Adams? You can, Derek. A big shout out to Derek. Dinky do from Scotty McClue. So there we are. I notice that the numbers are down. And that's why, as I say, I wanted to introduce the calls. But uh, we'll need to make sure that we don't have it running on all the devices. There's probably an arrangement, you see, that if you've got devices, everything very cleverly just um, cuts over to the other device and shares it and syncs on the different devices. And with the current weather, do you think we'll ever have a storm, Scotty? I think we might well. I can remember the storm of January 1968. And uh, Scotland was devastated by that. And when the Secretary of State for Scotland, uh, an, a, a remarkable man called Willie Ross, um, went to get money for Scotland, he was told no uh, from Westminster. And I can remember reading the news on ITV 1985, I think it was, when there was a storm in London and it hit Kew Gardens. And, uh, oh, the weeping and wailing compared with that. How's your dog, says Thomas? He's fabulous, Thomas, as I say. 
In his 14th year, he gets about a very happy chappy. That's, uh, that's the interesting thing about it. Um, so there we are. So as I say, I, well, I don't make apologies, but, um, you know, if it was a little bit seamy, all the pop-ups, then uh, it would be good to introduce the calls and we can get a bit of chat going now. You can all let me know. What's your favourite time for, uh, for broadcasting, for live streaming? Scotty, what's the history of the two new Calmac ferries that are overdue? Well, it's very obvious, Ian, you know, they're, they're overdue, and there's obviously some dispute going on at the moment, so I shan't comment on that either. Um, but I do remember I knew the original Ferguson's. So there you are. Long time no see, says Wadge. Absolutely. Hey, Scotty, how are you? Says Wadge. El Salvador. Hi, Scotty. How bad was the storm? Well, it's just picking up now. Uh, so there's a fair old, it was lovely and calm, beautiful sunny morning, and then the wind started to pick up and bringing the rain. We have a new dog, Chica the Akita. El Salvador, I like the sound of that. Fantastic. Ron King's watching. Thank you, do, Ron. Lovely to have you with us. Thanks very much to all of you that joined me on Facebook, of course. What's happening with the radio, Scotty? Uh, are they regretting their decision for love songs? Uh, so there we are. Well, um, I did hear through the grapevine that um, there's there's been a decline so there you are. So, uh, you know, that's all I'll say about that. Uh, Hi, Scotty, from a wet and windy motherwell, says the wonderful Liz Mooney. Thank you, do, Liz. Lovely to have you with us. And welcome, welcome, welcome. So until I take Skype off this device, I'm afraid I won't be able to take the calls. So there we are. But it's not the end of the world. We can sort all that. These are teething troubles. That's what these are. So there's a lovely miss. The show tonight was in Edinburgh, says Scott. Fantastic. Very, very popular. Old McClure, you know. Uh, fantastic. VJ. Uh, dinky do. And uh, guys, I don't mind. I know you do a lot of argy bargy with me, particularly over Brexit. But I don't mind. I just want what's best for everybody. And I don't think that leaving a market of 510 million people in 28 countries is best for everybody, especially when there's nothing lined up. I hear um, them saying, oh, yes, we, we got on very well in America and all that sort of stuff. Good, very good. But, uh, you know, it leaves us very vulnerable because when we were in the EU, we were part of the family. And do you know what amazed me? The way all the Brexiteers started slagging the EU as if they were totally unaware that it's our EU. We built the EU with the other countries over 50 years of peace and prosperity. And 1.2 million of a majority dragging us, dragging us, kicking and screaming out of the EU. Four countries, three against their will. Independence, Scotty, that's what we need, says Alistair. You need to sort the call, Scotty. Uh, too long in the tooth. I'm going to send you... A phone up. Excellent stuff. So there's what we'll do. We will sort the calls, but I thought we'd go with Skype. But as I say, it's obviously settled on the device. Um, Jim Heron's watching. Very, very talented man, Jim Heron. One of the finest artists I've ever met. The great stage designer. So there we go. Now, I have this. I got told some rather good news on YouTube that you can see it the right way around. Is that right? Can you let me know if you can see that the right way around? Oh, that's absolutely lush. That's fantastic. What do we got here? I'm just going to share this, guys. Let everybody know that we're on. And uh, I'll share to the pages as well. Let everybody know that we are live. Dinky-doo. How fantastic's that? And if you can like and share, but I need you all to get on to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel. Tap the bell and subscribe. Fantastic. What have we got there? Um, no, it's back to front, says Alistair. Aha! Now, that's interesting because on YouTube, it's the right way around. They say, no, we can read it. Seize the day. Horace. That's what it says. Carpe diem. Seize the day. 
Horace, the Roman philosopher. Oh, that's lush. That is absolutely fantastic. Now, tell me what you're all doing tonight. Are you going to have a nice Saturday night? This, as I say, is just a quick pop-up to say hi. I shall just um, share it also with a couple of the Scotty McClue pages. Now, guys, get on there because Scotty McClue has become a massive, massive international brand. So there we are. Robert Abercrombie, lovely to hear from you. And Dinky Doo from me, Scotty McClue. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Right, I'm just going to share this one. Uh, sad to hear you're not on the radio anymore. Pro Tem, I would say, Wadge. Uh, pro Tem. So there we are. They thought they wanted to try out love songs. So we let them do that. But um, there's been a substantial fall in the, in, in the audience. Surprise, surprise. So there you go. But that's, uh, that's what happens. Um, I, take, I take no joy in saying that. So there we are. But I did predict it. I must be honest, because I do know my radio stations and I do know my audiences. Uh, dinky do, Scotty boy. Hope you're well, says Robert. Uh, I'm no long in from work. I've been at the garage since 7 a.m. Feet up and chilling now. Yes, Alistair. I'm still going to get that big engine to run, Alistair. So there we go. It can't be too difficult. But, um, of course, it could be a variety of things when it hasn't run for some time. That's the thing. But um, we'll, we'll, we'll get it going. If she's spinning over, then, as you say, it's either fuel or spark. There we are. It's not supposed to be a rocket science. But the problem I've got with this particular model, and you'll know what I'm talking about, you can't get into the plugs uh, unless you move lots of stuff around. Johnny Garvey's watching. We just befriended each other today. Johnny Garvey, I would have thought you and I would have been friends a long, long time. Uh, I'm so sick of love songs. Um, it's so boring. I know El Salvador, really... What radio people don't understand is that the world wants to talk, you know. Um, if you need me to take a look, I will. You are very, very kind, Alistair, you know, but I just, I, I couldn't put you to that length of bother. That's the thing, but uh, it'd be fantastic to get an expert to say, I don't know, I know exactly what that is, you know. And, of course, there's little details. There's like a little cut-off switch in the passenger footwell at the front. You have to check that that's in all right. You know, we know the pump's running and all that sort of stuff. So there we are. Uh, my valves are set the same. Plugs are a nightmare to get into. Of course, absolutely. Can I tell you, have you any idea um, what the car was? You used to have to take the front wheel off to get into the plugs. Can you tell me about that one? So there you are. If you've got any ideas... Do let me know. Fantastic. Uh, I like you had to take the front wheel off to get into the plugs. It's no problem. I'm not that far away. So there we are. Oh, Alistair. My goodness me. You're a Fife man. Am I not right in thinking you're in the kingdom? So there we go. Having said that, I wouldn't be surprised if you drive a lot. Uh, hi, Scotty. I hope you're doing well. Horrible weather out there. My dog nearly got blown away. Oh, John. We're going to say, Johnny, how come you and I were not friends on Facebook for years? Or did you get a wee bit fed up with all the posting? And you thought, ah, I did enough. And a guy moaning yesterday went, oh, I get it. You're, you know, building up, but you'll not do it this way. And I thought, do you mind? I have been on social media now for... What, the best part of 15 years? Well, that's what I was going to tell you. I used to have long late-night calls in 1998 with an expert who was explaining to me how the Internet worked then. And I said, well, can we not get a server and build this and that? And he went, no, because you're trying to cram. It's like trying to cram lots of things down one pipe. He said, you know, it would just jam. Uh, yes, I'm family and I drive all day all over the country, recovery and repair. Oh, fantastic. So there you are. Well, we'll maybe have a word, Alistair, and see what you think. Uh, so that's that. Um, and uh, now, of course, 
the speeds have caught up. Because if you think about it, the radio was miles ahead of the internet because radio is wireless and the internet was wired. But now, because it's connecting everybody's computer, but now, although it's still wired, we have wireless. It's going to be clear you're going to have a quite chill night. Um, have you been approached by the new Scottish tab station? Also, wouldn't it be good if your listeners could support you to have your own radio station? The Stuart Walker Seymour. Did I risk it? Oh, yes. Um, to have your own radio station and opening it up, buddy. Scotty, who would host shows throughout the 24 hours with yourself, hosting prime time and encouraging youngsters to get into radio? You know, that's a very, very good thought and a very good idea. I have to say that is very, very impressive. So there we are. Oh, what we got here, I hope this isn't going to shut down because the lights are connected to it. I shall start it again. Quick restart going on there. Uh, that is a super idea. Who came up with that, Stuart? Fantastic. Good idea. Yes. But you see, when I came up to Scotland, to Scott FM, I had all the advice from everybody under the sun. Oh, that'll never work. And oh, it's, uh, you know, it's been called a poor wee chunter of a station by the head of one of the other stations. Oh, no. Oh, 10 o'clock. Oh, that's a graveyard hour. Now, this is all just a lot of nonsense. Uh, you're less than an hour from me, Scotty. It's no trouble. I'll run diagnostics on it. You'll know exactly what's wrong. It's okay to guess. But you need to see it. Absolutely, Alistair. Very fair comment. I do understand. You know, if you don't actually go to the dentist, he can't tell you what's wrong doing the phone. So there you go. Wonderful stuff. She might be a bit old for diagnostics, would she? 1992. So there we go. But I don't know if they're plugins or what have you. Um, Zikwai Tang. Dinky do from me, Scotty McClure. Stephen Menzies has joined us. How fabulous is this? Just like the old days. I'm in Tesco at the moment. Well, thanks for the advert. Zay quite dang. Uh, a wonderful place to be, I see. The weather is bad. The weather is shocking. Everybody needs to keep warm. Stephen Menzies, I hope you're not out fixing railways at this time of night. Can I have some love hearts, guys? Give us a tap, 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 tap. That would be wonderful. So there we are. This computer's just shut down. I hope we didn't lose everybody there, I say. If there's a fault, I'll find it. You will, Alistair. I just know you will because you're one of these guys I can tell. You're like myself. You don't give up. And um, my father used to say, he was an engineer, and he would have just sorted that in no time. And he used to say to me, it's as easy to do it right as do it wrong. And he wouldn't lie under motors if it could be avoided, he would say. Let's get that part out of there and get it on the bench. And he had one of these huge, big old angle poise industrial lamps, the bare bulb in it that lit up the bench. And he had a vice that was about that size. Massive, massive vice on the bench. He had an anvil. He had all that. Good evening, Scotty. I'm sure I'm on a call from Cambus Lang to the borders. Oh, for goodness sake, Stephen. Do you go way down to Crawford and things like that? And Elven Foot. Fantastic. Um, I uh, once broke down at Elven Foot and the lovely, lovely, lovely people at the garage came and got me and sorted me out. Fantastic. So there you are. Elven Foot. Right in the middle. Have you noticed if your car's going to break down, it won't do it just outside the house or anything like that, or it won't do it, um, uh, you know, right handy for the garage. It'll do it either out in the middle of rural nowhere, or it will do it right in the city centre in a busy lane. And when she breaks down, the 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 queue behind starts forming and start beep, 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 you know, and you feel it out and, and say to them politely, would you please stop that? I have broken down, you half-witted idiot. 
stop leaning on your horn, you half witted idiot. I have broken down. That's why I have put on my flashers. Or my alternator has packed in and I can't put on my flashers. Would you please stop hooting your horn, you half-witted idiot? That's that's the kind of thing, that's what you feel like, that you feel like sick to them. So that kind of idea. Um, I, I had a clutch went right in the city centre on a very, very busy Saturday afternoon. Clutch gone. And you get no warning. I thought, oh, something dodgy here with the old gears. Clutch gone. Uh, Dinky do, Scotty. I used to listen to you years ago on Scott FM when I was a nipper. Bring it back, Bob as well. Great to listen to you once more. Stephen William, thank you very much, very much appreciated. And Dinky do, I say. Look at this. Windows has recovered from an unexpected shutdown. I am very, very pleased to hear it. So there we are. Let's hope that the door recovers as well. Right, um, is it not time I wasn't here? What a lovely, lovely evening's chat. Just been superb to be on with you. Fantastic. And tell 10 to tell 10, share everything you see with Scotty McClue on it. We're already a massive international brand, but I want to build up the shows. We can do calls on here. We'll get the Skype sorted out so we can do calls on here. And also I take calls live on the YouTube shows. So get onto the YouTube channel, subscribe and tap the bell. Then you'll get notifications and will be popping up quite often on YouTube to say dinky do to every single one of you. All right, never ever miss a second of Scotty McClure. You miss a moment of McClure. You miss a moment of life. All right, so there you are. And I'm sure stuff uh, suffers from a degree of restriction because uh, we had thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands and now it takes a little bit longer to build up, but it's lovely, lovely being with you. Dinky do to every single one of you. For me, Scotty McClue. I'll sing you the goodbye song. Have a very safe evening. Take great care of yourselves. All right. Keep warm and safe. If you're out on call, away up to the moors and all these kind of things, Please, please look after your dear selves. Till then, from me, Scotty McClure, I say dinky do. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. A vita zaino reva and a cheerio. Cheerio, lads. Dinky do. Thanks for watching.